man. Like, in we're not starting off slow. It's not Jim Bob versus <laughs> versus Little Timmy in first round. This is some serious stuff. Let's get into winners round two. Zetros versus Yasha. I mean, tell me, you have some familiarity with both yeah, of these I've players. Yeah, I've played Zetros a bit uh, ages ago. And yeah, you're playing Greninja. And we see Yasha on Byleth. No rush down at all. Just going for the straight long range type of play. Well, let's find out right now. Byleth obviously always in the back of people's minds with MK Lowe's performance yep. recently. But that's a lot to live up to there, fella. I feel like if you're going to have any character to go off of, I think Byleth is a good choice because, like you said, MKLO is the blueprint. You know, you've got something to read, you've got something to look at all the time. Yeah. Because you've got the best player in the world playing the character, you've got so much to look out for, so much to learn. And hopefully Yasha can show me uh, what the what the DBFC uh, <laughs> transferable skills can lead to. Well, let's find out. And you know what? Fair play to that Levi tag. That Byleth ult actually kind of looks like Captain Levi. Oh, I'm not going to lie. Like, yeah, it actually right? kind of does. <laughs> I see it. I see it. I see it right now. But he is definitely not surviving. Gonna have to hook himself back. But alas, Zetros with an explosive opening. Looked pretty even there for a while. But I'm going to irk it out. Send him off the side. Looks like Zetros is going to be recovering a lot lower the rest of this game. Yeah, I know Belgium is usually seen as like the sister country from France. But, bro, I think Zetros looking at the dad right now, bro. He's putting in some work at the moment. Putting Yasha on the back foot. He's going to have to climb his way back through this uh, this first game. Just getting pelted by Shuriken after Shuriken. You know, definitely in the ninja training right now. I know he's a you know corporate Finder or a fighter for sure, but he needs to do something about it to rise up the ranks in, uh, for sure. Let's find out. I really like how Zetros is playing right now. Not like a lot of other Greninjas, right? Like a lot of other Greninjas, they use that frame that it just goes straight for rush yeah, down, yeah. try and not give you a second. But honestly, Zetros playing a bit more like a fox right now, yeah, right? Yeah, when yeah. they pelt them down with several shurikens, run in, force them into a situation they cannot escape from, and Paul Yasha just doesn't seem to have a way to deal with it right now. Yeah, as well as that, he's being super clinical in the way that he's finishing. You know, straight up dash attack. I mean, not even dash attack, uh, the down tilt. Uh, well, like a second dash attack into the up smash. And again, <laughs> I still have a combo extender uh, or a finisher. So, you know, great um, versatility from, or well, versatility from Zetros indeed. Such a shame, Levi. I keep calling him Levi. Unfortunately, <laughs> Yasha just not able to really land. And you know what? I don't blame him for not retreating to ledge because that's just such a scary place to be against a Greninja, yeah. right? Especially with how sort of finicky tethers can be sometimes. You get hit with a hydro pump at the wrong time. Yeah. Buddy, you're in danger. Yeah, finally, curtains. finally, Zetros is starting to show signs of bleeding. Yeah, you have to try to find a way in. You know, the door's not closed just yet. It has got a little bit of a chance. Just needs to find this kill. Get any way you can. That classic dash attack. So versatile in the way that you can do so many things with it. And the Yasha's uh, doing a decent job of showing it. Certainly is, certainly is. Still just trying desperately to find a kill. Greninja's hurt box so, so slender. Could be very awkward to kind of hit those nasty back airs. But this could be it. Going Ooh. nice and deep. You're willing to risk it all. And why wouldn't you as the tilt finally comes out? As we're going to 2-1. My goodness. Yeah, that F-Tilt came in clutch. Finally getting a kill on the board. Just trying to stay in it. And, oh, I think that was a missed input from Zetros. Definitely, uh, definitely didn't mean the F-Smash. Oh, interesting down ahead, just mix up the tempo, but it wasn't really a mix up as he just got blended straight into the air. That down tilt does everything, bro. It's that could that pays you bills. That that cleans my car. That dude. down tilt wins you games, bro. Forget the chores, it does everything for you. Wins Damn right. games. Well, that looked very, very convincing from Zetros, I gotta say. Yeah, I think that was a really good showing from him. You know, I like the way you said it. Like, you know, he plays a bit like more Fox esque with that Greninja. You know, he's kind of pelting him down, leaving him alone. And then when he finds that opening, it's like a shark in water, bro. It smells the blood. Bam, it's time to attack. I want to attack now. I want to take the stock. That's exactly what he did. Yeah, really, really aware of kind of what his burst range is. And, you know, Greninja's burst range is like the entire stage. Scary. But, you know, <laughs> really, really smart play. Really wonderful. Just not a whole lot. Yeah, she could do about it, right? Especially on a character like Byleth, who, you know, has amazing tools. Don't get me wrong, they've got that Nair, they've got great boxing tools, but mm -hmm. they do want a little bit of space to play with, right? You've got those ludicrous disjoints. So let's see if it can get the job done. No spike coming out this early. Definitely could have turned the tides, but alas. Looks like you're going to have to work a little bit harder than that there, Yashu, if you want to bring down this frog. Viva la France. Yeah, honestly, I can definitely see the shoutouts there. And you see Zetros just taking his time yet again. Just want to commit too much, and every time he does commit, seems to get a, la uh, get a hit. Just can't push it any further. And Yasha doing a decent job of just trying to bide his time, get some space, like you said, you know, be that distance demon. Sakurai called him for a reason, bro. He's trying to get that, that thing going. He just can't find it at the moment. He's getting rushed down too much. And right, finally, Nair is connecting on this low profile of a character, but it's just not enough. Can't convert it into anything. It's a so move hard to hit him. That is so, so strong. Barely even catches it before he grabs the ledge. My goodness. Zetros' reactions are inhuman. 
And I feel like Greninja as a character just gives you that like ability to react like that because he has such good buttons to contest with you, where it's in mid range or far away, or even up close. Like, bro, the character does a lot, and I feel like he slept on. Yeah, agreed. I completely agree with you right there. As finally down tilt connects, but just drifts out of it. Yasha just can't get anything going, Fabs, but still could be worse. Still looking better than they were last time. Yeah, doing a decent job. He's again just a little bit higher and maybe look for a kill soon. That dash attack is putting in a lot of work uh, for Yasha for sure. More of these shurikens coming out, playing distance, waiting for a mistake, and you've got all the time in the world, man. You've got so long. Yeah. Finally, an answer coming from Yasha, but I don't think that's going to work too many times. Dash attack, and it's, it's well spaced enough. It's not punished. <laughs> like it's the sorty, the sorty dash attacks always amaze me in that way. It's like, yeah, you can just space a dash. Still trying to land that back air, not quite coming through. Just a little bit too low there again. Yeah. Yasha just not used to how low he has to go to hit this Greninja. And I don't blame him. One of the shortest characters in the game. Yeah, if you, if you look at Yasha, the way he's playing, he's, he keeps empty hopping. And I think he's trying to find the spacing, but I think he's struggling because of Greninja's super good burst range. He can't really find the exact spacing he needs. And Zetra is taking advantage of that, kind of mixing up if he wants to be staying close or far away with these shurikens and just annoying with it. And then whenever he gets close just like that, finds that kill confirmed, whether it's dash attack, whether it's down tilt, the second dash attack, and uh, and gets the kill just like that. What I love about Zetros is he doesn't even really seem to be doing a lot of like platform confirms, yeah. which is the most common thing you see as Greninja. He's making his own, he's, ma he's baking his own oh. bread, buddy. He's throwing shurikens and confirming off of those. Oh, doesn't quite get the grab. Zetros with the three stock, and what a way to start the day. I was expecting the boot up rivals. Yes. <laughs> like, that, that's it. Okay. So, do you know what? You know, Smash maybe not be the game for me. I'm, I'm, let me try rivals. Let me, yeah, let's let me try, try that. Let's try. Well, it does have another life, another chance down there in losers. But my goodness, Zetros walking off stage right there. Insane performance on the ground. Yeah, really good from uh, showing from Zetros. I think they just look super comfortable the whole time. I don't think they were really ever in danger. They were always in the driver's seat. And you know, they really showed how strong they can be when they're on their A game. And I just want to say hats off to Yash. And they, may, they might be losing, but I think they're probably expecting to lose and yeah. I'm probably expecting to go too far, but it's just data, right? It's just data for the next tournament. So hats off to Yasha. Good luck and losers to him. And I'm, I'm just really hyped to see uh, more fighters players uh, playing other games. And I know there's no sparking in, in Ultimate, unfortunately. Uh, you know, there's no uh, X Factor or whatever. Yeah, wake there's up no DP. 2M. I'm well, sorry, bro. I mean, there's Wake Up DP on certain characters, but I'm, I want to <laughs> know why he plays Byleth. I'd really like to know. Uh, I would be what, curious. Um, yeah, why they play them. Well, I think it must be something to do with that kind. It's always good to, I think, I think just a sortie in general, right? Yeah, always I think a 